another Unity Quick Tip video. Today I'm going to be using the kit Twas the Night by Lisa Clemens. It is a really cute set and I'm going to be using Tim Holtz Distress Ink to create this really pretty background. I'm going in with a blue and then going to cover it up lightly with a black but going thicker in the white part areas. I want some of the blue to show through, kind of like a, a starry night effect. going over this multiple times to get the black really black and then I'm going to hit it again with the blue to make the blue stand out. doesn't really matter if some of the white shows through because it makes it look like a little starry effect. And I'm going to use the swirl die cut from Tim Holtz. And I'm going to punch all of those little stars out. Isn't that beautiful? I'm going to back this with some gold card stock later. I'm going to take my fan brush and I'm going to dip it in my paint and I'm going to tap it across my cardstock. Adding the white splotches makes for some really fun dimension. See? Fun! There it is, backed with the gold cardstock. I'm going to glue down my grass that I used a Lawn Fawn die cut with and glue down my card. I'm going to ink up my sentiment and I want to white emboss it so I'm going to stamp it on black cardstock with my Versamark ink and sprinkle on my white embossing powder and then tap it off. a really fun tip. I'm going to take my hexagon punch and I'm going to make a banner with it by just cutting out the end and it's going to make the V just like that. Makes it really simple and foolproof. You can't really mess that one up. I'm just going to glue it down here like this. I'm going to add my little puppy was the night and putting a pop dot on it and put them on my card. There you go. Thanks for watching. Bye.